All right, I'm doing it. Go live. Oh man, this is like really heart wrenching. Am I live? Okay, guys, this is the first time ever going live, so you have to bear with me just a little bit. Um, yes, Skate God is not dead. If for people who thought that, um, we're about to actually include my friend. We have a special guest today. It's gonna be amazing. Oh, you can watch it? Okay, cool. So we're good. Anyways, guys, let me focus on the video. I uh, appreciate everyone coming in and hanging out. This is awesome. Uh, wow, what a haircut. Thank you. By the way, guys, I got a haircut. And uh, for the people who are re-watching this video, yes, live stream, first time ever. Uh, a lot to cover in this video. And we might try to go for a little while just to have as much fun as possible with this. But I do want to start off with the people who clicked the video and saw, yes, Lance Sober uh, just announced that he's leaving Braille skateboarding, which is insane. He's pretty much most of braille uh he i shouldn't say most of braille aaron kyle created it he hired lance and then lance just did a bunch of leg work he went to la we did a lot of collaborations together um and i definitely wanted to say like yeah i don't know with, with lance mostly i guess he's just moving on to pursue new passions that was it that's all he said to people uh, i'm sure there's more that he's talked to lance about but they they've known each other forever so this is oh hey five dollars from sarah dici what's up who is that girl She's kind of attractive too. What? Uh, anyways, um, by the way, this is super chat. If you want, you can donate. That's all. Uh, anyways, so yeah, with Lance, um, he's awesome. And yeah, for me, a lot of people on my channel know me through Braille skateboarding. So for me, it is, it's a huge shot. It's crazy to see this guy who has helped me immensely with what I do today. I mean, if it weren't for him, Andy Schrock, Aaron Cairo, my channel wouldn't be where it is. Uh, we spent a lot of times together. Uh, like after the skate session, we filmed five to 10 videos in one day. And then we'd go post up in a, in a Starbucks and he would basically go on and on about like what he's doing for YouTube and like how he's going to grow Braille. And uh, he also gave me a lot of advice. He's like, this is what you do. So yeah, for me, it is like, it's also a sad day to see Lance move on from Braille skateboarding. I love their channel. I love what they do. They're freaking killing it. And, and I think at the end of the day, their main thing is that they want to make, um, uh, skateboarding as big as it can possibly be so for me i'm 100 percent down for that uh that's my goal as well um but yeah it's, it's crazy you know i met them right when i started youtube and uh th they liked the direction i was going and they were like yo let's like let's do this let's work together let's build you up let's do some cool things um uh, big ross donated five dollars big ross appreciate your boy he said you are awesome john you're awesome ryan mccoy yo people dropping 499, thank you so much, dude. Um, Ryan McCoy, put a comment down and I'll read it out loud as well. Um, it is really sad, right? It's it's crazy sad. And yeah, the responses have all been, they've been very positive on their channel. People have been excited to see Lance pursue something new um, because he's got a great head on his shoulders. I'm sure whatever he does, he will succeed in. But for the people who, um, yeah, who, people are gonna miss him. That's all, and, and it's sad. Martin Bunning donated $12.12. .12. That is so cool. Say my name, Liam Hall. Dude, thank you so much for the two euros. Is that what that is? That's euros, right? Anyways, uh, so that's pretty much the premise of it. If you want, you can check out. If, if, if live, you can't see it, but they just uploaded a new video called Lance is Leaving. It's a really sad video where everyone sits around and talks about Lance is gone. He's moving on. Sad music. Um, but it is really intense. It, it's an intense thing, and I love that so many people are being like, yo, um, this, this is crazy reading this out loud. Can you guys also see the chat or no? You can't see the chat, right? Can I drag the chat in the conversation? Oh, they can. Right, okay. Can they see it once the video is uploaded? Yes. Okay, cool. Maybe. Trying to get as little distracted as possible, but this is so new to me. Um, yeah, so people ask, yeah, Skate God. Skate God will remain. Uh, Road dis oh, wow. Jack Johnson, long live the Skate God, donated 20 SEK. I don't know what that is, but I appreciate it. Oh, whoa, whoa, all at the same time. $2 from one eye behind a camera. Did you see the petition for a new skate park at SC? No, but I'm all about that. Uh, Father Homewood, $5, thank you, dog. It's good Lance is leaving on a good note. Talk about your hair, though. You removed the blonde. I'll get to the hair in just a second. The Lance, we're almost done with the conversation. Um, Sam Vincent, thank you so much, dude. Do you love watching your videos in the UK? You're epic, you keep me skating. Dude, that's awesome. Yeah, I mean, the whole idea behind what Braille does and what I did initially with this channel, uh, for me, it's easy to get sort of sidetracked into the other avenues of YouTube, but primarily what I love to do is skateboard. What I love to do is try to grow skateboarding 
Um, and you know, I took a different approach to it. And a lot of people might not like it. And a lot of people really resonate with it. It's the same thing with revive. It's the same thing that I'm trying to do with progress daily. The, the idea at the end of the day is like, I like skateboarding. Um, I just, I, I just love skateboarding. Sorry. Somebody said a comment that distracted me. Um, I broke my arm skateboarding. That's not good. You skipped Austin Lynch. Did I? Austin Lynch. Um, going back to find you. Wow. Kyle Montagudo. Is there a reason you need to profit? Oh, wow. Someone did it $50 to sort of hate on me. That's pretty good, actually. I appreciate that. Thank you. Hey, Kyle. Thank you. <laughs> That's crazy. Adam King, shout, shout me out, my G. I love you. Love you too, bro. Um, reason to profit off of news. Yes. So there is absolutely a reason. Um, I think with news channels in general, it's to make a profit. It's not to uh, share news usually by the time they get in a position. But yeah, with them, it's like, um, yeah, if I can make money off something, I'll do it. Just kidding. <laughs> um, put slow mode on the chat. Okay, so I guess we're gonna move on from that. If you wanna go see the video, go check it out. Uh, Braille just uploaded a new video. Um, what is, okay, so people are saying that I'm skipping Austin Lynch. I'm so new to this, but I don't see Austin Lynch. I don't see it. Um, I know Austin Lynch though. He's like the homie. And if you did donate, I super appreciate you. Heard. Like, do something skating, like, that you maybe huh. big ross thank you so much dude I, seriously thank you so much man you've helped me to change the mindset when it comes to skating and just life in general through pd um yeah that's the idea the idea was to do something that's like i don't know just put a little positivity out there what's with the hair okay uh gabe john you inspired me to create every day as a free skater you should make another video about free lines oh yeah also shout out sarah in the background um, yeah, some of the hair guys, last minute, I talked to a few people who like my mom and Sarah, whose opinions I very much care about. And Sarah sort of insinuated that she liked the blonde or the, like the black, but she was really nice about it. She was like, Oh, I don't know. It looks cute. Just saying. And I was like, Oh, cool. So she put it in my head. And then my mom was like, boy, you look ugly with that blonde. That's how my mom talks. She's Korean. Um, so I was like, you're right. I, okay, so I got a haircut and uh, I dyed my hair black literally because my mom wanted me to. And I just don't care that much. The blonde thing was sort of a, uh, a marketing technique. And I was like, you know what? Black hair is fine. One eye behind the camera. I made it. I'm from Columbia as well. Represent. Yo, appreciate you, dog. Dude. Anyways, so guys, now we're moving. I'm coming on, on stage now. Check it out. What's up, guys? Oh, Brandon Joseph. Dude, appreciate you. From Seattle. Love. Um, we My hair looks like space. <laughs> That's hilarious. That too. Anyways, so I actually originally... Shout um, out to Anna. Shout out to Anna. What Anna? I don't know. I'm just shout out to people who are yeah, saying my name. Do your Thank thing. you, Nicole. Yeah, yeah, dude. If you guys know Brett, um, I'll be honest. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a little bit of... Um, flattering i watch brett's videos all the time i think they're awesome oh, thank you i appreciate I, that i love the new york vibes dude i love the quality thank you. Thank you. um yeah it's hard it's like on youtube it's really hard to focus on just excelling and uh oh look at that love your blue towel videos skate local thank you so much um that's so awesome yeah yeah it, it's hard to focus on just quality over quantity mm -hmm. and brett's like you know what let's do it a quality route let's do it see what happens well i feel like people have their different opinions on why they do youtube Mm -hmm. I feel like you and I have similar approaches within, like we want to progress daily. Right. And I feel like why I love doing YouTube is always growing my knowledge of, you know, editing and how to make videos and just challenging myself to new tactics. So even like still to this day, my videos are always doing something different, whether it's with voiceovers or integrating new techniques. Right. Trying to just grow. As yeah. As doing as hyperlapses or doing, you know, whatever I can. So I think the progress daily method is why I love doing YouTube is just because I want to be a better Storyteller slash cinematographer. Same here, because it's definitely like one eye behind a camera. I got to shout you out. Gillespie was supposed to DM you with the link to it. I'll, I'll look for that. Um, yeah, with, absolutely. When it comes to making YouTube videos, I think what works for us is that a lot of people see it as a lucrative career now. They think you can go into it and just make money right away. Right. Um, but what's funny is that me and you both went into it without like hoping to make a lot of money. We just went so into sure. it without like just for the fun of it. And it was like skate. It was like, let's just document skateboard. No one's doing that. Yeah, exactly. That's it. So, uh -huh. oh wait, here we go. Oh, um, Zoe. Damn. Oh, Zoe. She's she's the best. 
She follows all your stuff too. Yeah. Um, are we going to acknowledge the PD board? Yo, yeah, the PD board is actually a gift. Um, here's five dollars more, dude. Appreciate you, yeah. man. So sick, dude. Killing um, it. Yeah, thank you guys. This is super sick. Yeah. Uh, best pizza spot in New York City. Ooh, that's a tough one. Joey Pepperoni's, which is across the street, dollar pizza, not bad. Yo, uh, Sarah and I discovered a spot kind of close to here, but I already forgot what it was called. I like Two Boots. Two Boots uh, is good. They have vegan pizza. Salugis? Salugi. Yeah, Salugis or something. It's right in the street. It's, we should go there. Yeah. PD, Times Fortune collab. Coming hey. In the works. Yes, in the works. That's mm-hmm. going to be. I wish, I actually was hoping that one of these boards would be a, because uh, we have a third shelf, a fortune board, but you know what? We'll get there. We'll get there. It'll be cool because uh, the plans are to continue this. And yeah, if anyone has any questions as well, ask away and we'll try our best to acknowledge them. Uh, you and Chris channel inspired me to skate. That's awesome. Yeah. Skateboarding is really fun. And the whole idea with the channel with me, it's like I try to incorporate other things. And I know Brett does as well, because the idea um, is not just like trying to progress in skating. It's progressing in what you like to do. Um, so whatever is your passion. Hopefully you can see our passion for what we love and it inspires you to chase your passion the way we chase ours. So yeah, anyways. Um, Dang, the comments are coming in so fast. They're this coming is in, this crazy. is super cool. I appreciate you guys. Yeah, um, so much love for the Hill fam. Doing this, we need a Progress Daily, yeah, Revive Coming Progress Daily collab. What's up, Mari? <laughs> it's crazy, like when you're trying to read it, it's just going up. Yeah, this is crazy. Oh, but guys, I also want to incorporate a little bit of skateboarding in this video. Um, we have a carpet, we have a carpet board, and we have neighbors downstairs who will eventually hate us. Oh, Gabe. 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 Ulterior? Two bucks. Dude, Kate Skateboards, two of the most inspired. Kate Skateboards, I'm curious. What is Thank you. Hmm, what is that? Kate it's a good way to get a shout out on these things is by being like, yo. Here's I'm going to ask if we're going to make a sock that's suitable for microwaving. Maybe? A sock? Yeah. Potentially, yeah. yeah like one so. you can eat, I guess. Oh, Isaac Dove. Are AirBuds worth it? Thank you so much, Isaac. Are AirBuds worth it because the Apple headphones fall out? If, it, if the Apple headphones fall out, I don't know. I mean, the AirPods are it's, very similar. It's the but, wire that causes it to fall out. Right. Ears. I think it's the wires. Uh, yes, AirPods are definitely worth it. I will say that 100%. You, you guys can ask pretty much any question. My channel is mostly about skateboarding, but we're pretty knowledgeable. Wait, right. I have a question. What's that? Who looks like Bruno Mars that they're referring to? It's I've never weird. gotten that. Are they referring I've to you? Multiple okay, times. I was gonna say I've never gotten yeah. calls. I've gotten multiple times. Everyone's like, Oliver the Bruno Joy Mars Boy, guy? biggest tip for skate YouTubers. Thanks so much, boy. So Oliver the Joy Boy, this is oh wow, Big Ross. Big what Ross, is five oh, Ross. boy, yo? Um, advice for skate YouTubers. Uh, my advice is always uh, find what you love to do and try to showcase it in a way that's new and different. Mm-hmm. And this is. Not the biggest one, but it kind of is. Uh, you have to play the game. You have to try to collaborate with people. If you work with, like Brett and I have each collaborated with most of the skate YouTubers. Yeah. Like we've probably been shouted out each by most of the skate YouTubers. Thomas, thank you so much, my dog. Appreciate your face and your nose. Um, and that's, to me, the collaboration for what really excelled my channel. It's very rare, honestly, for a channel to get to like a million subscribers without doing like one collaboration. Mm -hmm. Um, Peter McKinnon did it, um, but those are all anomalies. Like that's like, that's like some glitch in the system that allows Mm -hmm. you to do that. I mean, I'm not saying his content isn't worth it. It's because he did those crazy hacks that just like blew up. Exactly. And there were really good hacks. Like when you watch those, you're like, how did I not think of that? Yeah. Chapstick on the lens and all these other things. Exactly. See, gone splash. Thank you, dude. Appreciate you. That's a um, novelty. Should we try to set this up a little bit and like turn the camera and like get the shout out to Joshua though? Yo, Joshua oh. Moby in the. Oh. Ow, jeez, Josh, you hurt my heart. Um, all right, let's do it. You want to flip this over here? All right, Brett, do you want to follow the yeah, camera? Yeah. Am I filming? Sure? Selfie. Um, so yeah, I guess it just depends what you guys want to move this. Um, I'm staying I'm right here with you guys. I'm right here with you. Uh, let me make sure. Yeah, Joshua Mulvey, I appreciate your face. I'm going to scoot this all the way up against the wall. And, yo, live streaming is crazy. Brett, can you keep your face in there so people can have something sexy to say? What's up, guys? What, what trick do you guys want to see? And then we're going to move this. You're like actually good at carpet boarding. All right, yo, we're getting ready for car- Hey, I just want to say that Isaac Doe, $2, heard about Jesus. What's your view? Nah, JK. Well, that, I was about to say, you're setting us up for some trouble, boy. <laughs> Um, here we go. Setting up this right hand. All right. Sick. Okay, cool. And then as you can see, 
Oh, I'm a tennis. You can carpet kickflip? Yeah, pretty easily. Boom. Pretty easily. Yeah, you can make as much noise as you want. Um, anyways, so I'm going to keep answering the questions while Brett just rifles off some mother freaking combos, dude. Um, I'm going to try to make this go for about 30 minutes, but yeah, guys, I appreciate you being in here. It's pretty, pretty awesome so far, dude. Um, 540 shove it. Okay. 540 shove? All right. I feel like I'm going to get hit. Even yeah, from right. Heads up. Put your helmet on. <laughs> There you go. Hey, Maycilia. I own a food truck. Okay, here we go. I own a food truck in Stanford CT, not too far away. Uh, it's at N-O-S-H Hound on Instagram. Come grab some free food if you ever make it this way. There you go. Wow, food truck. That's so sick. Uh, Maycilia, I appreciate you so much. Thank you. Jam Invasion. John, OMG, you're not blonde. I've been gone for so long. I just dyed my hair yesterday. So you're good. Sam Vincent. Triple flip, first try both of you right now. Can you do a kickflip? Yeah, do you want to switch up? I want to see a kickflip. I'm going to tag team. The left. There we go. All right, guys. You guys think he's got it? How do you do that? All right, double flip. Is this what you do? Like, I, not often. This is I, why you got the studio. Jeez. This guy is good. He's a pro carpet boarder. Good enough, right? Maybe okay, that Swiss bad. Army heel flip? Which inward heel? Um, you guys are stuff like tricks. Is Sarah monitoring or editing or what? Sarah is top secret project emailing. <laughs> she's making she's, she's doing her thing. Making the hustle. Like always. Ah, oh, switch heel. It's just like how we drop. Here, I'm gonna give you another one. All this right, big we... Ross with another two bucks for a frontside flip. Hey, wait, front, frontside flip? Yeah. All right. Okay, the money ears. And you just learn them. The money ears get the. They get it. I feel like I'm gonna land all the way, like, you know what I mean? <laughs> hey! Across the whole gap. I'm taking it. That was sick. Well, okay, did I. Isaiah De La Cruz. I'm gonna try to do a to barrel flip. Let's yeah. see it. If you have any recommendations for tricks you want me to try, that's fine. I'm not gonna promise I'm gonna land, but I will give you a barrel flip because I love your butts, your little, little butts. It's a little weird. Like a little weird. Just pan it up just a little. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, boom. Chilling. There we go. Oh, a little down actually. There. Right. Right. Are right. we gonna go to London? I'll be in London in October. So that's it. You're gonna be in London in October? Yeah. Some jelly sauce. Sarah, you should come. I need to take a. Yes. Take a thing over there. Okay. Ah, oh, any recommendations? Here, I'm gonna drop <laughs> just for the love a pot shove it. And then a 360 shove it. Dolphin Then flip. a front shove it. Dolphin flip? Yeah, that's not My board would literally hit Sarah if I tried that. All right, key shove. Key <laughs> shove, three shove, and I'll try five shove. Ooh, okay, I feel. Ooh, all right, five shoves. Yeah, five shove, there you go. Woo, okay. Come on, shove. <sighs> Anyways, so. Personal opinions, since this is a live stream that all of you can see, personal opinions on the whole uh, Lance leaving. What do you think? Does it make you happy? Does it make you sad? Is it inspiring to see him move somewhere new and different, a different platform per se? Or are you like, damn, I wish he would just stay there and do his dang thing. I want to know. Uh, go out. since I can't go outside and skate because we run out of Wi-Fi. And without Wi-Fi, this is impossible. Okay, it's so, like 32 degrees out right now. A lot of people said... They're sad. People keep saying, I missed Isaac. Somebody send money. I'm sorry. If, if you sent like a dollar, if you sent some money. I was shouting him out. Don't worry. Oh, you did? Yeah. Brett's got you. Yeah. Yeah. Brett's got you. Don't worry, guys. You guys. You're getting there. Yeah. Everybody's sad. See? Everybody's sad. Very sad. Yeah. This is a really good dude, though. I'm excited to see where he goes with it. Yeah. Me too. You know, he really did a lot to build up the Braille channel, I feel like, you know, and like keep it sustainable and did a great job with that. Yeah. So I think whatever he does, it's going to be. Exciting and successful. I agree. Yeah. I mean, look what he did with Braille. Like, it's like, you know, the dude is going to do very, everybody's sad though. Mm -hmm. I agree. I think it is sad. Um, and yeah, but why? Oh, Gabriel Hitchcock up and up. Getting some Euros. Hey, John, have you seen Alex DeCunha? I have. He's the new writer for Force Wheels. He's actually my teammate now. He's incredible. His skating is like freaking mind blowing and he looks like he's like 13. Um, so yeah, but yeah, if you want to see, hear about why he's leaving, this video will be on my YouTube channel. 
and you can go to the beginning of this video, you can watch it. Um, but right now, we're gonna hit try to hit 30 minutes, and there you go. Brett's gonna get it for you guys. First try. I'm gonna get clean 540 shots in the 32 degrees. It's so hard. Um, any tips for skating? Actually, yeah, for skateboarding, if you want to. Did you get that? I don't know. I, I think I missed him. Chow. I just broke Sarah's track off. I caught it. Oh, wow. good guys. Um, John, do a carpet board hard flip. I can't. My board would it would land. I could try it. I could try it. Um, yeah. So that's gonna be difficult. But here, how much time uh, remaining so far? So we're gonna do it for another ten minutes. So if you guys want to just um, ask questions, sorry, it's really hard for me to miss. Um, or it's really hard for me to read them because it's going so fast. I'm trying to find questions. Um, any on any advice for online clothing company? Uh, it's it's difficult. Mm -hmm. Clothing companies especially difficult now because so many people are doing merch. Um, I actually believe that merch will be like almost taking over. Like yeah. I think most people will be wearing merch over like fashion brands. Oh, Isaac, what's up, dude? Before I was legit asking about your view on God. I can't I can't talk about it on, on YouTube. So yeah, the channel would go. I don't know. Somebody, somebody like sort of ambushed with me with this question at a meet and greet. It was very awkward. He just said like, "Are you a child of Jesus?" Like in front of people, and I was like, you know, you, you, it's it's hard to go either direction because yeah. you're like, and of course you should be honest, but I'm just like, this is awkward, and I feel uncomfortable. Uh, Gabe, here's two more, dude. Gabe, you're okay. seriously, thank you, dude. Awesome. I have a question for you. What do you think about Facebook advertising? Because now, like, even if you say something, like we say, like. Dove soap, we're gonna get an ad on Instagram in an hour for Dove soap. I think it's kind. I don't know. It, it's hard. I, I want to know what you guys think about that too. What do you think about like Facebook and Instagram listening to what you say? Brett Barrow Hill, Big Ross. I'll try one too if, if he doesn't. Right, I'm gonna try. All right, Barrow Hill, Big Ross. I got I you. Figure out you. How to get um, a good pop -up this carpet. It's a little scary. I mean, with me, I can I can talk and about there's anything. There's so much expensive equipment everywhere. Like, I almost broke Sarah's setup. So. Wow. I can I can talk about anything on Instagram and my phone will change. The ads will be about what I talked about. And yeah, <laughs> I think it's very difficult. Um, but I understand, you know, like that's just the way, you know, like people are watched a lot more than they think people are. Uh, people are being heard more than you think. So it's it's just a world where there's not that much real privacy or any real privacy. And it's just something that I think we have to get used to. So, anyways, I'm gonna do a barrel. You do a barrel. I need to watch the technique on how you. I think. Well, I've done it before, but. Oh, it's happening. Sorry, barrel is happening. Thank you for the. It's gonna sell like earthquake. You donated, here. so I got you one. You have to land it. So three dollars just because because <laughs> I keep breaking things. <laughs> Shout out to Charlie. Yeah, hey, yeah, we're starting. Uh, so on this, we're starting a GoFundMe for all the things that Brett breaks. <laughs> oh, dude, Jacob. Wait, I actually know Charlie. What's up, dude? Sorry, to, I think he just texted me. I'll get back to you. Jacob Villa, this. what happened to Skate God? You gotta watch the beginning of the video when it goes live. But he left Braille Skateboarding. It's insane. But Burial View Blue. Oh. Yeah, I guess it's Gucci. That was impressive. Uh, here we go. Joshua Mulby. Let me make art for you, homie. Jo at Joshua underscore Mulby. If you want to check that out. Thank you so much, dude. Um, wish you came to New Jersey to skate. Uh, love you, Chris G. Dude, thank you so much. Uh, see you on Splash. Gabriel Hitchcock, Instagram. Gabriel underscore Hitchcock. And that's how you do that. Uh, luck of the Gabe seems to come to you in cash form. It's just easier to see the comments where people pay because it highlights the entire thing and flashes it on the screen. Mm -hmm. um, and that's why, because I'm trying to keep with everything else, but it's, John, are you still going to do a podcast? Yeah, we're actually, I'm testing this live stream format to figure out what I'm doing and how I'm doing it because, I don't know, it's difficult. As skateboarders, Brett and I are into so many different things that I don't necessarily want to keep creating platforms to just promote skating. Mm -hmm. um, so like, it's like, should I do a podcast where I just do skaters? Uh, I don't know. Probably not. Uh, Mac, thank you for boobies. Shout out to boobies. Hey, someone who pays $2 to have boobies set on a live stream, there's so much respect there. Yeah, it's a Jimmy. Um, Abdul Moomin Smith, love your videos. Notice that you eat vegetarian a lot. Are you vegetarian? Also, I used to skate when I was 11, but got demotivated. Any tips for getting back? You know, my advice, honestly, is to watch Braille videos about trick tips. Yeah, watch what they do. They have fun. Um, yeah, I would just check out Braille videos. Try to, you know, just if that inspires you, if you feel like it's something that you would like to do, literally just go step on a skateboard. 
go step on a skateboard, ride a little bit, mm -hmm. see how it feels. That's what I say. And I have to say this right now, huge shout out to Jimmy T1988 for saying I'm Guybrush Threepwood and I'm a mighty pirate. That's from the shout game out. Monkey Island, which I grew up playing. Literally one of my favorite games to this day. Um, my brother made you an animation and you saw it, Gabriel Hitchcock. Hmm. Oh, big, hey, big, big Ross. Big Ross coming through with He's, like, it's like, is it a fuck? Dude, yeah. My Insta is at Ross, R-O-S-S-V-A-T poetry. You featured my vid. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah. Anyways, well, guys, this is freaking super fun. Mm -hmm. I actually, I love. Yeah, this is really fun. I love this. Are you going to have Sarah on your podcast? I'm sure once I'm doing it more often, uh, I just have to make sure that the format is exactly how I want. And I want to do something unique. So, you know, Sarah, 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 Sarah's got so many awesome things. Um, cause I don't want to like accidentally do what other New Yorkers are doing as well. Gabe Alter, you're the best dude. <laughs> also check your Insta mentions. Okay. I will. Um, yeah. So how did I get on revive? I'll, I'll answer that really quickly. I got into YouTube. Um, I, I was skateboarding a lot. I, uh, went skateboarding with the guys and I had so much fun meeting Andy Schrock, Sam Tabor and all the people that I literally, um, I was like, I want to ride for whatever you're doing because it's amazing. Um, and he was like, join force wheels because revive is pretty much a hard thing to join because it's all of our friends and family. Once I got to know them better, they were like, do you just want to ride for Revive? This works awesomely. And I was like, yes, because I was going to ride for Three Block initially. Whoa, um, I didn't know that. Yeah, which was initially called Casino. Whoa. Yeah. Um, Isaac, thank you so much. Almost broke, but worth it. Do a Casper flip. Okay. Casper flip it is, guys. Oh, I think he's got it. We just got $5 from Eddie Van Axel. Dude, you inspired me to start skating. Just got my first board at 29 years old. Oh, at Eddie, E-D-D-I-E, -E, Van, A-X-E-L. Eddie Van Axel. Dude, for a sick t-shirt collection. Okay, cool. Thank you so oh, much, yeah. dude. Dude, that's 29 years old getting your first board. Dude, you're still young. Your legs are still good. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Really good start. Looking like me out there. Looking like a real G. <laughs> that's kind of it, right? That was definitely it. That was sick. Cool. I felt good, man. I felt real good. All right, guys, we got three more minutes on the clock. You were gonna get a thousand, but you ignored my request. Sorry. <laughs> oh man, that's a funny way to say it. Favorite trick? My favorite trick? Um, probably a thinky flip. Mine's nolly flip. flip. No way. Mm -hmm. Bam. We're actually doing the same trick because you're goofy. That so is true. I gotta say, Mac, uh, yo, Big J, I like what you do. Also, I forgot to say, Mac, I appreciate your face yeah. and your kids and your family. Uh, oh, Nick damn, Hammonds, yo, John, love your I started skating because of you and just recently landed my first kickflip. I DM'd it to you on Instagram a couple days ago. Check it out. Dude. Gotta check that out. John doesn't check any of his DMs. I'm so. really bad with that. I'll be honest. Don't take it personally. Mama's dad for Lance. Favorite board graphic? Um, oh, man. I was just thinking of my favorite ad, which is a bigger Van Vogelen ad where he's doing a back tail. And it's the board is like 30 feet long. It's so funny. My favorite board graphic, though, that's hard. It's very hard. Shout out to Rainer from the Philippines. Hell yeah. Shout I like things Sarah that are funny. Dean. I like funny things. So funny. It was a funny graphic. Things that are usually trolly and then kind of like step outside <laughs> of the, out of what is comfortable for an ad really make me happy. So guys, you got a minute and a half. Who's your favorite skater? Um, my favorite skater is probably someone like Chris Colburn. I saw a Jerry Sue comment. Okay. Um, Chris Mine's Colburn. Luke. Chris Colburn, really? Cookie. I really like him. Okay. Yeah. I know him. He's a good dude. I think mine's still Luana Oliveira. Ooh, the audio is trash. Oh, good oh. enough for the future. <laughs> hmm. All right. I'll actually try to fix that. I want this to be as good as possible. So for now, we're just testing it out. Sarah, Marquez says hi. Marquez. Marquez. Marquez, not that Marquez. Oh, it's not Sarah. <laughs> but people are shouting you out. Oh, here's a good question that we can probably maybe end on. How do you deal with people harassing you and kicking you out of spots? It bums me out so much. Oh, first of all, Noel Loyal. Loya, favorite meme at the moment. Oh man, there's too many. I don't know. I like I like the this. I think that's hilarious. Carrie, man. More shirts. Love the one I got. Yeah, dude. Got you. Uh -oh. Got oh, Sarah, shout Sarah out to say bucks. Gabriel Hitchcock. Wait, what? Can you say Gabriel Hitchcock? It's for his name. Bucks? It's his for name. Two euro. Gabriel Hitchcock. There's the shout out. Oh, Sarah Sankoff. You owe me uh, $2 now. 
Um, what was the question we were ending on? It was like uh, kicking out of spots. Oh yeah. Okay. So here's the truth with me. Um, it bums me out when I want to skate it, when I want to do the tricks. Um, but I'm never, I'm never mad at people for doing it if they do it nicely. So if someone comes up and says, you're not a skater. I mean, literally we've probably been busted 200 plus times. Like Brett and I, the combination of Brett and I, maybe a thousand times. You know how you see what you get after that? It's like, it's like someone saying hi on the street. Like I would probably be more weirded out if someone just said hi randomly walking by than a, a security guard taking me out. Mm -hmm. Gabe, thank you so much, dude. Um, Sarah, hurry up with the merch, Gabe said. Okay. Yeah, she will. It's, merch stresses her out. It does. It really stresses me out. Um, but yeah, on that note, oh, I'm just going to say, um, guys, thank you so much for tuning in today. Thank you for watching. This has been a yeah. very successful first live stream, I would say. This is so fun. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll try to set it up to where it's like better audio. Uh, we'll use an actual camera. We just have to figure out how to work this. And yeah, guys, I appreciate so much that you guys are watching the videos. And and in New York City right now, there's a lot of things happening. And it's fun to be a part of this creative scene rather than like I had so much fun being in California and Cincinnati where it was skate, 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 skate. Um, but I got Brett here who skates and we're gonna a, do a lot of creating. Pop up shop. Pop up shop coming up soon. April seventh and April eighth. If you wanna be there, come exactly. join, hang out. It's gonna be a lot of fun because all the creators for YouTube in New York City that we know at least. Yeah, a whole all friend group, there having whole fun. Big meetup. We're doing like a, I think we're literally doing, this is kind of an announcement, like a podcast thing with Sarah where we're all doing like a interview thing. It's gonna be really fun. Mm -hmm. So guys.